GT, based on our all new 650 twin uh, GT. Over to the right, we've got our Major Roach, a, uh, based on our Ford Tank and Alliance, indestructible as the name implies. And then finally on the left, we've got a fantastic build from Winston Yak Rock Crafts that has joined again, uh, our, our Dante GT uh, on, on the uh, GT base. Talk a little bit about the Continental GT here. Uh, we've got Lester Harris. He's going to talk a little bit about uh, what's gone into this bike. You know, it's a blend of both style and function. And we try to bring a little bit of the style at, at our tech center in, in Leicester. And Leicester gets to bring uh, all the technical expertise that his history of racing brings to our brand. Leicester, if you could walk us through the bike a little bit. Yeah, thanks, Adrian. Yeah, well, this is it. This is the, uh, the GT. This is a derivative of the new 650 uh, the Royal Enfield launch last year. Uh, Strangely enough, we were heavily involved in the design um, of the original GT um, about 10 years ago with the single cylinder 500 engine. Um, when this bike was launched, uh, to a, a lot of critical acclaim actually, the industrial design guy decided it would be a good idea to do a, uh, to do a limited edition and look at some areas on the bike that we could, we could improve. So, We've done a fairly extensive amount of work on the bike without losing the essential um, essence of the motorcycle. So clearly one of the things that the wheels are obviously different, we started with, um, with uh, different rim widths so that we could run uh, stickier tyres. We changed the front suspension to uh, only conventional forks. And we also decided to um, uh, make some new triple fans and we made these with a feature here which allows us to adjust the offset of the forks which is, uh, which is an aid to refining the handling characteristic of the bike. It's the sort of thing we do in race bikes um, uh, and it's, it's a good development tool actually. Moving back towards the back of the bike we have only these rear suspension. Um, there's quite a bit of engineering in, the, in, in the, the, wheel, the wheel, which you can't really see from the outside, but to make wheel changing uh, an easier job. 